Rolling with Nat20, I'm Nat20, and we're back with post-game content in Dragon Quest VIII. Since the last episode, we spent a while in the mountaintops grinding out metal slimes, and have increased our levels a few times. We've also gotten a fair few ranks, and some new fun abilities to be playing around with. Now, I was going to hold off before turning the video on until we found something interesting, but I think I think this qualifies as interesting. What is going on here? We just finished doing some gambling and resting at Baccarat uh, to come across this scene. What? Ah, it's blinding me. I can't see through the spray. Barrel squid, prepare to meet thy maker. Why do you do this, squid? Do you want to fight the king squid? Oh, this is a fight. Uh, no. Uh, but yes. So this looks like it's gonna be like an alternate boss fight, or maybe uh, maybe even just a monster recruit. I don't know. Um, but I think just just in case I get my ass handed to me, I want to save to make sure that everything that I did during all that grinding keeps. So save. That's gonna mess up the frame rate just a little bit. There we go. Let's fight. You wanna fight the giant squid? Let's... Yeah. Let's gauge your strength. Bring out the B team. B team. Let's see how hard these guys hit. And with what? And how easy he is to hit. Wow, that was an effective hit. 142. Okay, he seems rather squish. It's not giving me any boss music. He doesn't do a lot of damage either. Well, maybe this isn't exactly a tough fight. Maybe this is just supposed to be kind of funny. I mean, he is just sort of splashing people. Well, he seems to have a fair bit of hell. For the amount of damage he's doing. Yeah, it's like, he's real good at soaking damage, but there he goes. Alright, that wasn't too hard. Wasn't hard at all. Interesting, though. Thank you. You saved us from disaster. I mean, you were getting splashed. But what are we going to do? If Cash and Carrie hear about this... We'll have to make sure it never gets out. It's gone too far now. We'll have to shut him. What? I just beat that thing that was kicking your ass. To buy them off with tokens. Please. We'll give you 200 tokens if you promise not to tell Cash and Carry about any of this. No. Are you trying to get more out of me? I can offer you 400, but that's it. No more. You think so? I think you can go higher. I said I wouldn't give you any more. 400 tokens is my last offer. I think I'm telling them then. I think they can I beat my that I offer. Wouldn't give you any more. I said I wouldn't give you any more. <laughs> 400 tokens is my last offer. They they won't let me refuse. I have to take the tokens for my secrecy. Thank you. I'll have the tokens credited to your account. Okay. Then it's a promise. Not a word of this to anyone. Hey, Penta. Welcome to our post content romp. We finished up doing some grinding and just encountered this squid and baccarat that was giving these people a lot of problems, but all I was doing was splashing them. And they were like, we'll give you 200 tokens to not tell Cash and Carry, which ironically, I was on my way to talk to Cash and Carry. Already, so I was uh, like, "No, I'm telling them. We'll give you 400 tokens." No, I think they can beat your offer. Just come up to them. Hey, I have a secret. People are trying to bribe me to not tell you. Oh yeah, what they offer? Not telling. What's your offer for the information? Long time no see. Carrie and I are still getting along well, like brother and sister. Hey, check this out. Remember that image of my ancestor in the trial room? After we saw it, I did some research in the family archives. Turns out, 
that the family Golding is a special bloodline connected to some kind of evil force being sealed away. When the bloodline ends, the world will be shrouded in darkness too. I don't really get it, but there you have it. Anyway, I'm starting to get the feeling that all these weird going on lately are related to my father's death. Yeah, yeah, the, the squid was kind of a cute fight. Like, I, I didn't think we were going to kill it. I saw that thing and I was just like, aw, they have a little squid buddy. And they were like, murder the squid. And I was like, it's playing with you guys. Hey there, did you come all the way out here just to see us? I'm like touched and stuff. But if you really want to make me happy, I don't really see no blow a lot of money. Ha ha ha. Well, joke's on you. Because I'm up a thousand two hundred tokens today. I'm taking your money and I'm leaving. I'm leaving town now. I'm leaving town now. But where will I go next? I didn't have plans. I didn't have plans. And failure. Text. Text. A lot of things that rhyme with next. But I could have come up with something. Oh, we gonna fly around. Fly around. Something in my gut's telling me to check this valley again. Because there's no reason for us to ever have to come here. After we've already done what we've done. First and foremost, Nat. Hold protection, please. Second. Can you ring the bell, Yangus? Well, let's get a saber type. I think I smell a wandering monster. If the bell doesn't work here, that's only a big bummer. But what did I make when I use two of these on the skull ring? It's a sorcerer's ring. Ooh. All right. Now, did I have any other alchemy ideas? What am I trying to do right now? Um, little direction list. Kind of just want to fly around, poke around in a couple areas, see see what I see, and then maybe go see how that dungeon feels now. The best shield, a ruinous shield. I don't have a ruinous shield. One shield, two shield, and the holy water. Hmm. What might those shields be? For a saint. Mm -hmm. I'd buy it, might be ones I have equipped. I could go buy those two bronze knives and finally make the stylish helmet I never made. Um, holy room, flowing dress, and a magical skirt. I don't think I have those, but maybe I do. Um, dark robe, fur poncho. don't have the magical skirt for that, but I don't think I have the flowing dress either. But I can make a magical skirt out of a bandit and two magical items, which if I had to take a guess, and I could be wrong, as I think I might have tried this before. Two magic beast hides? Yeah, I wasn't into that. Uh, oh, 
I don't know. Premium moles. I got some of that. I don't know how to make super spice cheese. Or cold cheese. I don't know how to make a highly strung cheese. Alright, screw it. I'm out of the alchemy until I think of something. But what does this do for me? Increases the wearer's maximum MP by 30 points. And increases wisdom. Yeah, I think I think I want that on Angelo because it seems to be just straight better than these. Um, okay, it's five less wisdom, thirty more MP. I'll take it. I'll take it. And what do you have equipped? You have the meteorite bracelet for the agility. You've got the agility ring that we should change up. And you've got that mighty armlet. Okay, let's just put this away and equip this titan belt back to you. Because the agility was good for farming, but we don't need all that now. Now, because I can't uh, use the tiger, I'm less interested in exploring over here. I just know they had to have put monsters somewhere new monsters don't know where i don't particularly want to look everywhere but i also don't particularly want to be told either is that island that's not special anymore because i keep running into it and thinking it's special Wow, we see that darkness from quite a distance, don't we? Yeesh. Okay. Uh... That's Minnie's castle. But I didn't explore it too much when I first got there. Maybe there's something. I think my holy protection is still in effect. Alright. How far out will you let me go? Because I didn't really explore back here at all. Ooh. I figured there was a monster here that I could recruit because I, if it was, if the purpose for this area back here was that, was that, uh, there was a chest, then Yingus would have sniffed it out for me already. But he didn't. He didn't sniff out nothing, nothing, nothing. That was enough to kill that griffin now. We're all extra powerful now. It's nice. It's nice to be an extra powerful. I thought that fight was going to take one more round, so I was not ready for it to end. <laughs> there is a chest back here. Yangus! Because he can't smell back here. Yangus. Oh, man. You tricked me with your smelling abilities. Oh, yeah. We can get milk, can't we? Give me that milk, cow. A mini metal back here, but of course. You guys just get out of my way. 
I have holy protection on. Why are you here? You're so unimpressive. Yeah, it wasn't enough. Just, just mash him, just get him. One more hit does it. It'll be worth like 20 experience. 454. Still not enough. Did my holy protection wear off? Is it not working in here? It wore off and I didn't notice. Hey there. Hi. Oh, hello. It's there's this nice little beach down here. And a gigantes who wants to play tag. You're it! Gigantes gangst. Alright, well, you know the deal. We're gonna do an audition. Now, I forgot to switch out the person in the A team, so you're gonna face the B team today. B team audition. Boom, get him already. Man, Cybot's so good. I'm bums me out these B team material now. Do you guys deal enough damage to take him out? Or you guys gotta retreat. Oh, or it gets the double psych. Oh, you guys did it. Defeated by the B team. Uh, yeah, we'll bring them along and we got all three of these guys and I have heard that They can do a special attack together if you put them all together. So that's it seems like it could be fun And Slight differences it does look like the gangster's probably a little bit better because he's got a little bit more attack, a little bit more HP. Does a little less defense, but a lot more agility to make up for it. Sapper Slapper, death moves, and other abilities? None. Interesting. What if I put both of these guys in the same team because they got a little fiend thing on them? And I bet if I still had that last fiend guy, maybe. Maybe. Oh well. Oh yeah, this guy. Play around with that those teams for now. There's a stronger version of the Cybot out there that's epic. The Cybot is still pretty epic, even though he's not good enough to be in the A team. So I can only imagine. Alright, well while we're here, Mini, I have at least two, if not more, mini medals for you. How do you feel about all that? Hey Mini? Mini Mini Mini. How many do I have actually? I don't know. I don't want to count. I'm just right here. Take them. To 88? Yep, I need two more to get that Metal King Helm. J 
Just two more. I think we can find two more. The controller smells odd. Fuck it, full heal. Alright, alright. So... <sighs> on a search for mini metals, it would make sense to pop holy protections and get on the back of the cat and run all around the... basically the first two continents and see what I missed before I got the key. That might be what I have to do. Might see some of those monsters along. You know what? This place has changed dramatically. I'm a little bummed out that the that the top of it that I could land on is gone, and I never figured out if there was any importance up there. I mean, I did find one monster, but he kind of sucked. Um, yeah. If any were changed, it would be this place, right? How do you feel about the bell here? Oh, he's a coming! Big boy coming! Rah! All right. Let's take a look and see what we can find out here. If anywhere got monsters or anything added, it's this area that's all blown to hell, I think. Man, you guys want to stop me? You guys are punks. You don't even know what you're up against, do you? Ooh, I can get MP from those birds. Ow. Okay. Well, we'll check this attack out, because it's cool. The hustle. Jessica, do the hustle! Yeah, that toxic zombie had no business fighting. Tiger. You enjoyed the hustle, Penta. Oh, my holy protection wore off. Not that it's helping that much, but I, you know, maybe it's helping some. Somewhere out there, a monster I will find. Alright, just, 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 just. Nope. Kaboom! That's right, super throw just for you. Just for you, Griffin. Some more. Okay, I didn't see any monsters down the cliff. And though they don't spawn in if you're too far away, I think that was close enough to have them spawn in. It's a 
any way I can get into this crater. Protection we're off. We're not catching too many fights, so I think the holy protection is helpful. Skeleton soldiers. They make the first strike, but they suck. How did we let them get the drop on us? Are we all rolling ones for perception tonight? Oh, you survived a little more than I thought you could. I thought Jessica could one shot you. Well. Despite it being as strong as I am, these guys are able to live a little harder than I thought. They're better than I counted on. Okay, what do we find over here? Already been over there for the chest. That doesn't mean that they didn't put another monster over here. It's new since this place blew the fuck up. Mm -hmm. Um. Well, there's the one monster on this island that I do know of that I found that we could go poke at. Mm -hmm. Maybe recruit, I don't know. There was uh, the big gold golem over here. I don't wanna, I don't wanna fight these guys. But, doesn't look like they put anything new on this island for me. I'll pull the trigger if I'm wrong about that and I just didn't find what it is. What am I missing on this island? Is there a monster somewhere hidden? I whistled by accident, it's not what I wanted to do, but I'm happy with the results. I'm totally down to just get these guys money. Uh, I'm into holy protection, but I've just been doing so much of that grinding earlier that I just whistled out of habit but you know what i got a thousand five hundred goldish for that whistle very good whistle good job yangus i'm not mad at that whistle oh that gold golem was out here there's a chest to the left of the Neos entrance. Like if I walk in or out here. Maybe I missed in this area. Oh, coming out of Neos. I mean, there's that one up there that I got. Uh, oh, here's where that gold uh, golem was I was looking for. Let's see if they we can get them to do their big attack. Here comes critical hit and their two eyes. No big bonus attack yet. Oh, here we go, here we go. Ah! <laughs> the delayed reaction. I have too many. Um, I think it's Jockey. I think Jockey's the one to get rid of. What do you think? Jockey got a lot of agility.
It could be Blade Wolf, but I think it's Jack. I don't know, there's a lot of these demons. Hmm. Alright, Jockey, farewell. Goodbye, Jockey. We can go get you anytime I want on that little island. I think there's another one. Maybe a little sharper left. There was one that was over on the peak of the island, like further down that way as well. I got that one. Unless you're saying there's one like. Yeah. And I think I got the one that you're referring to, unless there is a third chest. But I think I did good on the chests. At least here. I'm going into the safety. I can't bring the tiger to scare everybody. Would have been cool. Alright, can I jump into the crater here? Jump into the crater! That's that's an intense crater. Uh Alright, well, let's fly away from here. Fly away! see what there is to see on the way to returning over what is that? Is that anything that looks weird from the sky it could just be a stone or something I guess Uh, I guess it is just a stone. It just seemed different from the sky. Oh, hell yeah. They suddenly attack. Why would they do that? I just want them for their gold. You took our leader. Give him back. He was the best among us. We are but soft gold. We know not how to be golems. See how flimsy we are? Golems are not meant to be like this. We need leadership. Uh... Alright, back to flying away. I don't know if there'll be anything over here. We're gonna go take a looky loo. See if anything's changed up on a mountain top. I couldn't figure out anything. Okay, this would be the little monster village, which I think maybe I should also be checking out again at this point since we failed to save the world. That might be interesting. I wonder if there was anybody to talk to about anything while I was hunting down the soul stone. looking for any areas that might hint me to land there and find something cool uh uh 
Oh, that's just the tree. I was like, that looks odd. Okay. I want to land up here. And see if anything's different up here. Then I have another idea of an area that I found close to Trodane near the beginning of the game that they never brought me back there for anything. I don't know if I'm strong enough to wholly protect here or not. Hmm. Ah, I'm not. But that's also because there's a bunch of dark skeletons up here, but they're too stunned to move. I'm leaving. It's a short goof thing, but did I get the first King Slime crown? The one in the well by the desert? I did get that. And uh, I, I think that might have actually been still the helmet Yangus was wearing uh, during the boss fight with the Dark Lord, because I think this Raging Bull helm finished while we were uh, in post-game. <laughs> Alright, you got anything new to say? Can't resist anything shiny. Not worried about a snapdragon though. Maybe I should have switched to my sword and done a dragon slash. Maybe. Just Probably not. I think this is okay. That worked out just fine, man. Just fine and good. Okay. Um. Something shiny. That's pretty shiny. Man, that'd be some use for me being able to use the items like a tool like that. Can't resist shiny objects. Buries them in sand. I don't get it. Is this different at all? A snapdragon? Well, I think I will use this dragon slash. It's just wrecking. Just all the wreckage. All for you, dragon. A spiked steel whip. I don't believe I've had one of those before. Well, this trip garnered me a steel spiked whip, so it might have been cool.
read all that out loud again because I did that but oh but I was hoping that maybe something different or something extra would happen I'll watch the bird we're gonna do anything I doubt it I'm not gonna I can't use it. The game's smart enough to recognize that I'm inside. What's well, about to be nightfall? Well, might as well wait just a sec. Don't you see me hanging out with this one? Give up. What? Yeah, all right, I'll leave. Thought that could hit everybody. Just a group. Just a group. Is it? Is it not night? We didn't look at the sky. There's the moon. It's night. We didn't get our little it's nighttime thing, but. All right. Well. That's a bust, too, for now, or forever. I don't know. Uh, Alright, so this other place that I found earlier in the game... Where was it? This is Fairbury. And this forest here, this, this forest struck me as odd. Because it never brought us back here for anything. Never made us be here for anything. I didn't find anything secret or special in here. Kind of like the game just forgot about it. But I certainly didn't. Just here. There's not too much here. With these barrels to bust. There's this stream. I really don't understand what the, the point of this area is. I feel like there has to be something. Maybe it's something that I have to be here at the right time? This is a, a bit of an odd clearing in the woods. And having the moon out has meant a lot for a lot of things. But it's not working out right now. Hmm. This is really just an empty area. I feel like it exists for a reason, but the developers forgot that reason. Like they were gonna do something with it, but then didn't. Like, I, I'd wonder if that area either doesn't exist or has something in the 3DS version. Like they knew it wasn't going to have anything, so they cut it out, or they were like, eh, we need to put something there. Uh, here's the waterfall of old. 
from long ago. It is pretty funny just how close Fairbury is to Trodade. The fact that we meet Yegis on this bridge but through flashbacks and then we just start the game like right here presumably like 20 minutes later <laughs> they needed a place for the intro doesn't the game start out with you like at the town i thought the game started with you arriving at the town maybe i forget maybe you do start here and you emerge and you go to the town I think I've looked over here. It doesn't start off at Fairbury. Oh, right, right, right. It starts off with the camping scene. Okay. So yeah, I guess they'd have to have somewhere for them to be camping. It's not what I wanted. At least I didn't hit whistle. bothering me that these dark creatures are everywhere messing up my exploration it bums me out because I just I just don't want to be getting in random fights with them and they're there they breach my holy protection because they're jerks up there mayhap this area isn't anything or mayhap I'm missing something come on slimes for real you for real think this is a good idea slimes Holy protection didn't give you a warning that you was outclassed. Oh, there's that little monster guy over here, right? Yeah, the puppet guy. From long, long ago. Hmm. Uh. Well, there's no reason for me to need to go back to the dark island. Uh, anything up here yet? Is this just like a nice view of the town spot? Or presumably where we were supposed to land with our flight to be incognito, but I was just like, fuck, and I'm landing right in the gates, and the game didn't say shit. Uh, I don't think there's anything here. I did a pretty good job of sniffing out the truth.
trying to think where the things that I missed would be. You know, I certainly didn't ever come over here. There might have been a monster or treasures over here. I'm pretty sure I didn't come over to this part of the island. I just landed and went right up. Nothing in particular, just stuff that I haven't got before. Uh, trying to see if I can figure out anywhere else to go before I just go fuss around in the bonus dungeon at the dragon altar thing. Yeah, there's a chest over there. I didn't think I'd looked over here. What's it gonna be? Mini metal? Final magic water? That's okay too. Can I tie a greed up here? I don't know if I've gotten all of them so far. I mean, I, I highly doubt them. That I've gotten all of them. I'm at 88 right now. There was a lot of me not remembering where chests I couldn't unlock without the keyword, never backtracking to them, which is where I imagine a fair amount of them are. Argonia is the one with the extra dungeon? Interesting. I was thinking that that might be the case considering uh, the story bit leads us to Argonia at the end. You gonna lead me on with a missing person quest? How are you planning on doing that? I was trying to think where there would be potentially a uh, an issue to solve, but I was coming up with a blank, and I didn't really want to go to every place. I've done uh, I got all the treasures in the dragon graveyard, but maybe not the whole desert over there. And I'm pretty sure I got. Golding's Villas. The shops in Argonia change after a while? It is true, it looks like the bazaar is gone, which is interesting. But. That's why there's mysteriously two temples here? That, that did strike me as odd when I found this place. Also, what am I doing on treasures here? Is there stuff for me to find? Seven? Yeah, there's lots of them. <laughs> so many complaints about the bazaar closing early that we had to let traders set up their stalls in this building instead. Oh, yeah. What you got? What you got? Got this razor wind gloomerang. Ooh, a zombie bane. A falcon knife. Nice. Uh... None of these things I want. Except I do need to take just a quick look, you Lou. I must have gotten all those because I came back like almost immediately after finishing the nest in the dark world uh, and sniffing out all the treasure there. I was like, uh, well it still exists in the light world and I can fly up there now. Can I go in in the light world? I can. And it's got its own, it's, got its own set of treasures. So I just kind of did that dungeon back to back twice. Uh, the zombie slayer is a holy tool and a zombie. Do I care? I might. 
Do I care to spend 6,000? Yeah, we'll get a zombie bane. The promise of no Meg was an empty one. No Meg would have been great. That's that's how I would have wanted that dungeon to end. Better dungeon ending than they came up with. Uh, give me that and give me that. Do it. Will that work? Is that the holy symbol at which they speak? No. A holy tool, it says. Maybe. Probably not. Hmm. A holy two. I picked up all the treasures with the ultimate key. Uh, I did Argonia, Pick'em, and Arcadia, I, I believe. Uh, I didn't know there was one at Red's Hideout. I forgot that, but now that you mention it, yeah. And I thought there was one at Trodane, but not deeply enough to go fuss with looking in Trodane over it. But I'm glad you mentioned Red Tide That was on my list of places to go check out. Three DS blacks out items that won't work. Kinda lame. It's kinda lame. Might be a little helpful for a first playthrough, but eh. Uh Shit, I thought I had the holy tool that I needed. There we go. Yeah, I, I got that recipe, but I don't think I have the right sword for it. So I've been looking at that one. I, yeah, I just don't think I have the right sword, wherever that is. Hidden intro day in somewhere. Oh, probably in that chest vault that I didn't refind. Take that, because I think that's what I need for the Mask of Darkness. Drassia leaf. One Drassia leaf costs a thousand. Fuck yeah, I'll take you Drassia leaf. Only allowed one Drassia leaf at a time. Well, that's fine. I'll take. I'll take that. Ah. Uh. I have what it takes to make a sage's stone? Interesting. <laughs> you can hide the leaves of the alchemy pots by extra. 
That's a funny thought. It's like, oh, a lost mine. Burpender. Just still standing in front of her, put it in the pot. Oop, I lost it. I need another. I don't know why she's limiting us one one per person. I'd hella buy up her leads. Why is this here? You can get an unlimited amount of them at that sticks tree. Hmm. Uh, sticks tree. I recall not a sticks tree. I'm not sure what you're talking about. Oh, that one. One sage stone you get in the citadel. What's going on back here? Start talking to people. Alright. We will. But first, we'll be back. Because part of the reason that I didn't find everything in Trodane is because it took me so long to find a map that by the time I did, I was just so done with that place. And the memory of that kept me from ever going back. But I thought, I had a sneaking suspicion that I recalled there being a treasure area in here. So I'm back with a vengeance. And... Did it, did it. Did it, did it, did it. <laughs> no! I've done this before! Just let me in. All right. I got lost as hell in this place the first time. The first time I ran through, I didn't even find that key. I was very upset because I definitely spoken with enough NPCs to learn about the key that can unlock any chest. And they were just dicks about it. Turn back, this is not the right way. Yeah. Over to that stairwell, bottom right corner, over there. Interesting. We're thinking about it. We might do like a little bit of our yes, this room. Oh, I forgot about this room. Get our post-game romp, the rusty old sword. And a seed of magic. Alrighty. Yeah, I've been thinking about it, and I think at this point... This not It's not necessarily spoilery, since I've given it a go, and I feel like... 
I've found pretty much all I'm gonna be finding. Uh, still don't want to have the alchemy recipe spoiled until post the final dungeon. But reminders of where these these uh, treasure vaults were, I'm glad to have because I'd seen them. I just forgot to make a mental note. Or a physical. Shit. Ah, that's gonna get us close. Eh, well, they're not the most close now that I remember exactly where I'm at in the world. We'll get there. I got the ones in the mini metal castle. Um, I found the Puff Puff Club, and I imagine I got the the mini metal there. So that was a fun find. I had been spoiled a little bit about something to that effect, though not nearly as much. Like, I was still caught off guard. That's what this is? And I saw the room and I was like, oh, this is where the meme I've been seeing is from. <laughs> uh, damn it. Where am I? I'm on the wrong continent. I'm not exactly poking around to get 100%. I do want these chests that I just couldn't remember where I'd seen them before were, though. Funny part about the whole Red Takes Your Horse arc is that you can get the Venus tier first and Yangus doesn't tell Red the first time around. <laughs> You can just totally skip talking to Red, go over to that place, and be like, Oh, there's a random dungeon over here. Let's do it. Hey, Red, I forgot that I said one day. There you are, Red's been waiting for you. Yangus this, Yangus that. She's obviously got something she wants to get off her chest. Can't even skip Angela till you finish. Essentia. Jeez. Got guts, I'll give you that. I ain't. Look, we've got to go and do these things all. I just thought I'd come and say hello before we had to go. <laughs> you think I don't know what you're doing? Old brains told me you're gonna fight Rapthorn, ain't ya? Oh, oh, right. So you know then. Sorry, I should have said. I won't be sorry if you get rid of him. He's a pain in the neck as far as I'm concerned. But you lot, you're having a laugh, ain't ya? Yeah, you better take me flail of fury if you're gonna stand a chance. But I'm only lending it to ya. Once you're done, I want it back. I'll come looking for you if you try and run off with it. Got it? Thanks. Don't you worry. I'll bring it back once we've done in that geezer. See ya. You take care, you hear? Ingus obtains the flail of fury and puts it in his bag. Alright. We're not done stealing your stuff. Wherever you put it. In the 3DS version, because she's part of the party, whatever you show up here, she just leaves to go to her favorite chair. That's pretty great. I worry that I didn't find, I didn't do Escanthias. Do 
because I'm not remembering doing that. The flail has no skill associated with it, but it hits everything in the field pretty hard. What is... It's a flail. Able of hitting multiple enemies in a single swing. Alright, well. No. Escanthia doesn't have any of the treasure rooms. That's what I thought. My, my memory of when I was trying to remember where those treasure rooms were, were showing up to places having Yangus sniff, and then figuring out that way if I was good or not. Alright. Let's zoom on back to Argonia. Argonia. Go down. Nah, there it is. You go at night to the Chancellor's house, you can inspect the mirror. Interesting. Is there any reason to inspect the mirror? Is it like a little funny thing? First and foremost, it has been a good long minute since we did a real save. But first, how much did sell levels? 79,000. 29,000. 15,000. 8,000. I was hoping the last would be like six. <laughs> That'd have been fun. Uh, yeah. I wasn't paying too much attention. I was just mashing. Then I was like, "Wait, I'm saving up the right one." I think. Yeah, we did that for about two in-game days. Caught a good five levels. And they, they were a good five levels. Like, Genghis' MP went up from like 70 to 100 off of those. And he was having problems staying stocked in MP. Alright. You. Looks like the peddler was right. Said Trodane was in ruin and I didn't believe him. But now we know it's true. And their messages stopped coming here. One of our men was sent over there to find out what was going on. When he got there, he found Trodane in total chaos, overrun by monsters and everything. You're already in the post-game dungeon and continuing any time later. You know, level 40, the stuff in the post-game dungeon wasn't hard, it was annoying. not just the Chancellor who's gone missing, you know. His wife and the maid have gone as well. Alright. And you say the Chancellor's house is up the hill. They want us to go check out this missing Chancellor bit, right? Bazaar finished a bit earlier than planned. Remember that day when the sky turned red? The bazaar was cancelled after that. Knock knock! I'm busting in here! Uh, last time I sniffed, there was seven treasures, which means I did a piss poor job looking around this area. Do not know what I've seen and what I haven't seen. So I'll just have to assume that it all needs to be checked as I go.
Actually, I didn't really notice there was no music. I had it turned down a little bit too much. I couldn't hear anything other than the sound effects pretty much anywhere we were at. Okay. Now the mirror in here does look a bit brighter than the mirrors in other rooms. I'm trying to figure out what in the game would have led me to want to poke at the mirror. There's no other mirror has been something you can trigger. Ooh. Uh, mirror world chests oh I like chest All right uh, okay probably this way what kind of monsters live in mirror world the normal kind Ah, the emulation might have broken the effect of the glowing, but there's a maid outside that tells you that the mirror glows at night. That would definitely be something that uh, would point this out as something to investigate. Not post-game, but certainly missable. At what point in the game would this have become accessible? Like, when I got the wings, I'm guessing? Ah, after the Citadel appeared. Makes sense. I unfortunately did all the side questing with the wings I was going to do before making the citadel appear. So when the citadel appeared, I was like, alright, well I've already done all my side questing, so let's get to it. I did my side questing right after the game of the wings, but I don't believe I ever came back to Argonia to check anything out. Aside from uh, when I got that key... Although that was earlier, I think, to go get all that stuff. Is it my map? It's a Hellsaber. Interesting. Narrow bladed weapon with a devilishly sharp blade. Isn't, is that maybe what I was trying to make with the, uh, what recipe was it? That, that would make a hell saber, I think. <laughs> Got the original game guy, don't read it no more. Got it all memorized, at least the important stuff. Alright, well, Mercury Rapier is cool, but let's equip this Hellsaber. Some of the recipes are useless. Yeah, even in game they warned me about that, like the axe plus the gold uh, chunks. They're like, here's a recipe you can make if you want to be sad. There's a thought. I should be throwing Ori Calcum at stuff. I did recently get a lot of it. I hadn't played around with it because for the longest time I just had the one. Now I got a bunch of it.
What can I see over there? What do I think of it? I wonder if I actually have the stuff that it takes to make the ultimate boomerang and I just don't realize. Down, Cyclops. Now well, we gotta face the big boys. I, I like all of the weapons that the main character can use, which is unfortunate. It ends up being a real toss-up. But I'm with boomerangs because I like having all of the abilities that can hit all of the enemies. It makes a lot of the side fights, especially early on, go quicker. Uh, okay, we're getting hit a little bit harder than I'm really paying attention to. These guys are rude. There's nothing you can do to damage me. I have Omni Hill now. <laughs> what will we find around this corner? Ooh, this chest. I bet I can't access it. Yep. Babe. Yeah, Jessica's magic explosion is a good one. I loved having Jessica bang everybody all day. It was a good way to handle the early game. Still a pretty good way to handle things now, just having her kaboom everything. You can get away. They're big, they're dumb. I don't think any of those have factors in it, but, you know. Confidence. This place isn't gonna give me a map and I know it. it. Makes me sad. I like the map. Even if it would just fill one out for me so I, I didn't feel like I'm messing up by not doing it myself. Ah, oh, yep, they got me. Oh, they got me. Oh, that was a big desperate attack on Jessica. Oh, I don't want to be all done. So we calling out the teams. You want to have three big boys? We'll have three big boys. Mm. How you feel about that? That's how you feel. That that those are some strong feelings. The mind breaker. Uh. 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 No. Would you like to do another? They're like, no need. We can do almost as much damage with three individual attack. 
Just about. Okay, uh, uh. Well, this, this place seems smaller than I thought. You can get sniffer treasure. We didn't have you do that. Did we find them all already? Ah. Much smaller than I anticipated. Okay. What you got going on in here, buddy? Help me! I'm picking you! I'm the Chancellor of Argonia! Who get out of here! We need a troll's belly with an hour! I have too much to live for! Before I do any of that. Uh, don't even care. Trolls don't care. Door is shut tight. Fight me. If I bowl yum, juicy humans in my tum. The boss troll is so engrossed in his cooking that he doesn't notice he has company. I thought that was going to be more of the run. What's good, Ib? How's it going? Well, we had it. What? Louis. Then let's be seen how strong he has been. We trolls don't be knocking toughens. You're looking a bit tough. <laughs> You is wanting to eat my dinner. No, you is not having it. No, no, no. Boss trolls. Got two night shifts where you get two days off. Nice. Days off are the best. Well, I mean, we, we took care of other trolls with this team. Delayed reaction. Alright, they're not that good. You know, they hit for like a hundred each. Um, maybe they're pretty beefy. Like, this one still hasn't gone down yet, and it's taken like. There we go, it went down finally. I was kind of figuring by the way things are going, they would take one of them down, and they did. Proud of them. Real proud of them. We're just gonna, you know, prep up just a little bit for all this. See if we can take him out in two big power moves. You chose the wrong target.
Tsukiri? Tsukiri psych? But what good is a psych without just a little bit of oomph behind it? You're going to school tomorrow for the first time in a long while? Oh, good luck. Imagine things will be fine. They're certainly intimidating with everything going on. Yeah, we'll give him a nice little pickety poke with Angelo. Pickety poke. Ow. All right. I don't think we need to go full full blast. I think we got it. Good enough where we're at. I think a nice little Giga Throw. Typhius Maw. Throw down a Kaboom. And a Falcon Slap. Oh, I didn't mean Kaboom, I meant uh, Kabizzle. Whatever. That's, that's okay. Dang, Yingus could have probably done that by himself. What? If you is not here, I'd be having his scrumptious you bring him out. But I could be the crow. So maybe this will be just a dream. <laughs> Maybe this is all just a dream, dies. Thank you, thank you. If you hadn't come along, I'd have been in a troll's belly by now. What a waste to end up a troll's dinner after all my hard work to become Chancellor of Argonia. I must repay you for this. What could I give you? Of course. Here, I'd like you to have these. Two seeds of strength and three seeds of life. Nice. Seeds like that kept me alive in the cell. Well, I should be getting back. Farewell. They're doing split classes on alternating weeks. Really an interesting way to handle things. Probably work out pretty well. They have you doing online classes on the weeks that you're not there in person? Evacuate! Evacuate, evacuate. The mistress refused to sleep in the same room as that mirror, so now I have to sleep in here instead. We should just get rid of it, but they say it's too valuable to throw away. <laughs> the other weeks are online. Eh, that, that'll probably work out pretty well for you although my initial thought before I thought of the other weeks being online was that could be pretty cool you know a week classes a week to do your homework Did I check the black market cupboard after getting the Venus tier uh, maybe Not sure. Not too stressed out about picking up all the, the mini medals. I didn't imagine finding all of those. I 
feel like if I was going to be extra certain that I got all of those, I'd probably have to start doing that hunt from the beginning, knowing where I was going. There's no way I'm going to remember which ones I've gotten and which ones I haven't. The Yangus' sniff ability could make things a little easier in post. This Metal King's Helm. 91. Eight more and I get a dangerous Bustier. Okay, Iron Man. Oh, it probably got put in here, didn't it? Metal King Helmet. The ultimate helmet. Bestows a strong resistance to a variety of spells. Oh. Who shall get the helmet? Yeah, it's time to give up the Mercury bandana. Time is now. I made a zombie slay. I don't know if it's gonna be any good, but I got one now. Alright, so what is what is the recipe? It's all I was missing for this was that rusty old sword. And the only reason I was missing it is because I forgot that there was those chests in Trodane. But now we have all the pieces, so let's make this sword. Make my sword. Oh shit. All right. Now. From here. Ah, oh, man. I feel like the odds of me beating that monster arena with uh, my team. These three guys with their special ability might be able to do it. Or if I pull out the weakest of the three and replace it with that new healer. Let's give it a go with this team of three and see how, how well they do. Part, part of me thinks that they stand no chance because they have no sustainability. Part of me thinks that they might be able to brute force their way through it anyway. We shall see. Do, 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 do. Oh, no, I, well, do I, I don't think anybody's knocked out. I'm just going to go sign up. Sign me up. Yep. This one. Want rank S, please. They have no sustainability, so I don't entirely think they'll be able to do this, but they hit really, really hard. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give the team owners a big in the red corner. In the blue corner. Critical hit, aka two eyes. Uh 
Uh, yeah. Death move, Mindbreaker. Aw. Oh, one of those missed. That would have been rough if that whack had worked. That would have been really rough. Yeah, they're doing good damage, but I, d I don't think they'll be able to make it without any sustain. Although, they're getting kind of lucky against these things making terrible decisions. Oh, shoot. That's not good. I got unlucky with that confusal there. Yeah, I don't think this team can do it. I don't think they can. There's no sustain. And it's it's super important. He's confused and has no idea what to do. Well, don't stop doing that. Cause you just killed one of our dudes and now like I don't even know if we're going to get to round three with this team now. But I think the two of these guys that are stronger and my thing that has the heal that would lock to this thing might be the answer. <laughs> Maybe, maybe. Wait, it's still confused this round? Oh my. I mean, it snapped to its senses pretty quick, but that caught me off guard. Of course, it wasn't my Gigantes that gets the desperate attack. They can still do a move, the two of them. Okay. How long does confusion last? Only like half of a forever. Just half a forever. Yeah, but... Well, that was to be expected. I would have been very excited if that plan had worked. Still mad you can't even heal Dazzle if it hits you? You're just stuck with it? There is no Undazzle. There is no mundane spell. Although that would be pretty funny. Alright. Sorry, Argus. We're trading you out. Oh, right. Knocked down is awful. Yeah. Knocked down has upset me a few times in this playthrough. 
Okay, with this, hopefully we'll have enough sustain to get through. And I don't really have, with the monsters, I got a better plan than this one. So if this doesn't do it, I'm going to have to assess if that was a, a luck equation that went wrong or if they're just not capable. Ladies and gentlemen, the Monster Arena. Let's give the team oh man, I, I remember when I was impressed with your voiceovers. We have our hero in the blue corner. Cap it's a glorious contest. All right. Jeez, just Im immediately? Okay, good. Isn't affected. I was like, just immediate desperate attack and draining some of the MP. Uh, kind of the worst way things could have gone. Oh, but we get a desperate attack too. Okay. You need to heal, Octavian. Focus on some heals on your next turn, because I do not want you to die. You are the sustain for the entire group. Multi thrust? I mean, I guess that's not a heal. Did that cost you MP? It did. Don't waste your MP on that. Heal! There we go. Oh yeah, the death move. Slapper, slapper. What just happened? Delayed reaction. Oh. Uh. All right, I feel better about this move. I don't know, or about this team. I don't know if the <sighs> slapper will have any effect on the metal slime, but I'm pretty sure desperate attacks will, and they have. Uh a good chance of getting desperate attacks. Octurian can be a moron sometimes. And they all can. The, the Archfiend was casting all those kabooms on other Archfiends and waiting until there were no enemies and then being like, oh, these guys can only do physical damage? Let me just cast Insulate three times in a row. It's a fight so tight, even... Get some. Good, desperate attacks. Yeah, whatever, use mid heal. Waste your time. Darn it, Octavia, you're supposed to be healing people. <laughs> We're getting all these attacks of desperation. Good, good, good. Octavian. No, attacking. No, you're that's the worst option. Heal yourself for the other guy. No more do that. Okay, heal yourself for sure. You need to heal yourself. Like like it's your job. Cause it is! Cause it is! Cause it is your job! No, yourself! That red slime did have the jukes. No, why aren't you healing yourself? Why, Octavia? Stop being cocky, that heal slime could kick you and you would die.
killing me, Octavian. You're killing me. See, it knows how to heal. Oh, you learn. You learn from it. This this is fine. Let it heal up. And let it get stomped out. That round did go pretty well, at all things considered. Like, Octavia was giving me a heart attack, but it, I, guess, I guess knew what it was doing. Octarian. You are about I feel like Octavia rolls off the tug better, but that's not what it is. The battle for rank F will be the battle to end all battles. And the champion will have to defeat none other than the man himself, Mori Mozzarella! We'll let Mori have his moment Isn't again. The creme de la creme, the battle royale, the mother of all monster arena contests. In the red corner, we have our heroes monster team. In the blue corner, captained by Mori, numero unos, it's Mori's glories. Music. I both love Mori and find him very annoying at the same time. It's a weird it's a weird feeling I have for Mori. Alright, you guys can do this. Nice. Okay. That might actually work out a little bit. Oh, wasn't desperate. You gotta make it desperate. Okay, you either gotta hit a desperate attack on the thing, kill the slime, or kill the guy in the middle. But stop hitting the slime with your stu- Oh, you did one damage to it still. Okay, okay. Those little pit pitalances of damage, though, the heal slime thing will be able to heal it up no problem. Shit. My healer went to sleep. God, you, need, you guys need desperate attacks. You were doing them like you were doing all the desperate attacks before. Where are they now? Oh, you woke up already. Okay, you weren't asleep for long. Oh, but now you're asleep. Oh. Foul breath doesn't affect you when you're asleep. Okay, Arcturian, we need to heal. We need to heal from you bad. Uh. And. No! Were you out of MP for it? Why did you waste your turn like that? Uh. Yes. Yes. Yeah! Okay, okay. Yeah, you. You, you, you had enough MP until you did that multi thrust. It may have cost us the fight. I mean, now what are you going to do? Multi-thrust is all you can afford. Okay. I might kill that. Delete reaction. Man, it wasn't even enough to do that. Ah, shit. Hmm. 
the official game guide suggests the Golem Trio. When I found out about the Golem Trio, I started making room for them because I want some. Because it sounds awesome. Okay, I think round two went particularly well, but I think that that kind of just got botched. I think this team can do it. I'm going to send them out again. I believe. I, they were pretty close like I feel like with a little bit of luck on their side in that final match They were just taking way too long to find that desperation attack Our Tyrion was screwing up the heels It's a his Alrighty. Get that slapper death move. Oh jeez. Do it again. If I can get not hit with that confusion, that would be excellent. That's fine. Didn't even work. All right, don't don't be wasting all your desperate attacks here. Also, Arcturian, don't be using your MP like this. Please stop. Unlearn multi thrust. Unlearn. Alright, well, he's been kind of focused fire. Stop using multi thrust. It's such a waste of your MP. Some fiddle. Damn it. Okay, well, he tried to flee. And now he's unfuddled. That's fine. That is absolutely fine. Octavian would like to learn Omni Heal, but already has two moves. Should a move be forgotten for Omni Heal? Yes, Octavian refuses to learn Omni Heal. Multi Thrust is maintained. Octavian, why? Is bed. I get to stab him three times. The fans are going absolutely in. 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 A... All right, we'll start this match off with a heal up. And a schmicky smack to the face. Nice way to open the flight. I love it. I love it. Oh, that's problematic. I'll show you what a true heal is. Alright, now I'm a little worried about their big boy now that he's oomphed.
Oof. Shit. Alright, Octavian's down early and this guy's oomphed and he's making it. Oh, that was mine. Okay, I thought I was getting hit with the desperate attack. Ooh, but yeah, I, th I think this went poorly. That that oomph is gonna kill me. Man. Yeah, but it was it, the oomph lasted long enough. The oomph, the oomph took the fight. All right, we'll give that one more go. That seemed like a very unlucky run. We'll give it one more go. Alright, last try. No, another grand on my team, please. Ladies and gentlemen, the Monster Arena is proud to present a Rank S Battle. Let's give the team owners a all right, yeah, the first round kind of just whittles me and is there to maybe get off that lucky thwack that the box does or some of those fuddles, but they're not too bad. That'd hit. That's not good. Okay, well at least they can't be fuddled while asleep. That's something. Wake up! I don't know if it's just impossible for that to happen in the monster arena if my guys are luckily monsters that are immune to it happening or I'm just getting lucky it makes me nervous every time Son of a bitch. Okay, good. I was like, I need my MP. Don't weird dance it away from me. Alright, get that full heal over there. We're too serious to be dancing. I don't like it when you use the multi thrust. That one actually got a fourth one out, which was kind of okay, but still. It's not worth the extra damage. That was a big decrease in defense. We're 
we're done with Mimic King. Onward to the next round. Where hopefully we don't get that oomph off on the big boy again. Because in all the rounds I've done this, I ain't seen that yet. And that was bad. We didn't even get past. That was the first time I wasn't able to get past this round. It's gonna be it's gonna be Get it. Get it. Ooh. Kill yourself, Octavian. Can you heal yourself, please? No? See what happens when you don't heal yourself, Octavian? If you'd healed yourself there, instead of making that worthless little poke, you would have survived the desperation attack. But now I feel like you've lost us the tournament. Octavian now. That's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking that I might switch out Cure for Octavia, because Octavia is just being stupid and getting killed. like we're gonna make it to the final round to uh, just kind of lose maybe how much health does this guy have left oh are we making it to that final round we get to see the final round again to lose immediately because we can't survive a hit Yeah, I'm gonna try switching out the healer. This was the last go with this group, and Octavian keeps letting me down. Oh, I guess we lost. That's fine. That saves us time. I thought it was our uh, Cyclops that ended up victorious. Oh, no, I already chose. All right, we're gonna try this. Because maybe A, not having the options will make Cure smarter about curing. And B, we've seen that agility do work with dodges before. We're going to have to hope for the best here. <coughs> Hopefully we win it. Ladies and, gentlemen, and if we do, that's cool. If we don't, maybe we'll try one more go. But it's getting to be about that time, I think. Part of the reason for the late stream was uh, figuring out food plans, and food should be done here soonish. All right, put me to sleep. Put me to sleep. I would have been mad. I'd have been so mad. Wake up. Good. I'll go back to sleep. Forfeit. 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 
That went terribly. It's unfortunate that there's no forfeit button. I mean, I probably would have hit it by accident at least once or twice by now, but still. I won't see. So I ain't winning now. I don't want to see all of this fighting for my inevitable loss. I already know. I have no sustain. I might be able to beat this group. Probably, in fact, but the next one's going to kill me. Oy vey. Alright. We'll give it one more go. Because I am planning on ending the stream for the first time ever. That guy has a multi heal? For the first time ever? Rather than waiting until the last minute, be like, who am I gonna raid? I'm taking this moment because I don't need to look at this. So that's what you heard there for a second. Yep, we'll do one more round after this and see if Cure can pull anything out. And then I don't know how much of uh, the dungeon, how long that dungeon is or how deep or how hard it is or how long it's going to take me. But I think there's going to be at least one more episode of Dragon Quest left for the YouTubes after this. Maybe more than one. Delayed reaction. I kind of like the delayed reaction bit. Oh no, Steros! There he is, I'll keep us alive while we kill him. Last go to see how this goes. And, well, maybe it'll work out. I don't know if that's just like healers way too squishy to be surviving at this rank. But it was the desperate attack that took him out. So we'll try one more time. And just see what the cards hold. Ladies and gentlemen. Hopefully they hold a victory. It's a camp. All right. Go team. Don't let the healer die. Just don't, please. Is the story of this game any good? I really enjoyed it. It was a lot of fun. Uh, after the beginning? Yeah, the beginning takes a little while before it starts really going anywhere. Um, I mean, this the story in itself is good because of the humor and, like, thematic that they put into it uh, more so like the humor like it's it's not the deepest story uh, not the most shallow story ever though there's a lot of side stuff going on and you kind of get to learn a lot about the characters along the way uh, not everybody but you get to learn a little bit about 
a fair few of them. I was satisfied with the story. I thought it was fun. I, I thought it was a good fun story. Maybe not like a thinker. I didn't know Tornico had his own dungeon series. I did recognize both those characters from playing uh, Final Fantasy slash Dragon Quest Fortune Street on the PS2. Itadaki Street as it's referred to in Japan. Speaking of which, uh, one of my buds is streaming some Fortune Street, which is where we're going to go on the raid after this round, because this is the final round we're doing. Hopefully it works out, Hope maybe it won't, but we'll see. The team. The mo if we can manage the monster arena without going and getting anything better. We've come pretty close. Come pretty close a couple of times. Also, how's it going, Jammerly Bob? Don't believe I've seen you around these parts before. Thank you for joining us. Get that death move! No worries, Penta. You came back in time to see our last run at the Monster Arena before calling it a night. And we'll have to pick up the uh, rest of post-content, which pretty much I think as far as I'm concerned, the rest of post-content... Damn it, they got that on. The rest of the post-content is that dragon dungeon uh, and then looking stuff up. You know, breaking the blind seal. Taking the blinders off. Might still have a few episodes left. Saying that that last dungeon is long. I wouldn't put it past level 5. Level 5 makes their, their post-content stuff usually pretty deep. I know in uh, Dark Cloud and Dark Cloud 2, the post-content dungeon is the longest dungeon. That is a good point. If they lead me to another dungeon after this, that'd be pretty nifty. Okay, we got the Dolan. I need you to throw down a heal slime. Heal up our big boy. It's all the same zip code. Yeah. Give me another heal, little slime guys. See, look. So much better than Octavian at the heals. Maybe less survivability. Maybe doesn't do any real damage out there. But actually healing people. Give me a favorite little heal slime. Drop a heal on yourself. Alright, this this I feel okay about this run. We, we have a chance. Arcturiate is strong, but Cure just feels smarter. I think it's because Cure doesn't have other spells to uh, blow their MP on. The fact that the only spell it has is the full heal. Whenever it casts a spell, that's what it's going to be. But unlike Arcturian, who can blow all their MP and accomplish little to nothing, the slime doesn't do that. That being said, we saw the downside of Heal Slime as it got taken out by, like, a single desperation attack in our first go. But, I mean, even more he's bringing a fucking Heal Slime. Now 
<laughs> yeah, if we can get that lucky first round crit on this liquid metal, we are good to go. Because most of it is our people want to keep hitting that liquid metal, but they're not doing anything, so they're not focusing on anybody else. Wow. I'm surprised that the heal slime actually did one. Okay. I don't think this is going to work out. Okay, I was like, did you just double full heal? I was like, no, they have one too. Yes, here it is. I'm feeling good about our odds. Feeling good about our odds. All right, two eyes, this is your battle to mess up now. Don't you do it. Don't you mess up now. Don't you do it. You can win a cow. I don't know. <laughs> better, better than silence. I came up with a rhyme. <laughs> Get their desperate death. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh no, you put me to sleep. This fight's so boring, you put me to sleep. Look kinda lonely out there, pal. <laughs> oh, we got chat shit talking the opposing team now. Mori's gonna be so upset. You put my heel slime to sleep. Don't put everybody to sleep, that'd be really rude. Uh, fell into a deeper sleep? Wake up. Okay. Oh, we lose one of our guys. Oh. Uh, okay, it's, it's shit. Get, get it, Brontes. Get it, Brontes. How much health do you got? 561. Don't you dare go to sleep. Don't you dare go to sleep. Don't you dare go to sleep. Get another desperate, get another desperate, get another desperate. Get him! Uh. I was close, but you did it. You did it, and we are the winner of the rank A or rank S battles! Yeah! That's how we end the first episode of the post-game content by winning the Monster Arena. Pew, 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 pew. All right. We made up a whole new rank for you and you did it. Yeah, you were laughing before that I kept throwing down a thousand more gold to do this, weren't you? I suppose I should give you your prize, eh? Here you are! A dragon robe. Ragazzo. No! Now, I must call you champion! Every day without the fail, I am here in Arim, striving to make the better monster team. In my mind, all I am thinking is how to make the team stronger, how to give it more go 
Gusto. Gusto. I am nothing compared to you, champion. Grazie. You really make my dream come true. So do I get the final prize? This is my arena now, Mori? Like, you've given me everything else. This is my arena now, right? Unless you can give me the ability that you have to bring the monsters back to life. That'd be cool, too. I've been waiting for this day. For the momentous day. I finally find the hell of my monstrous pit. My monster arena. We're changing the name first thing. Everybody agrees monster arena is better. Only you lack monstrous pit, Mori. Let me give you one last reward. When you leave, take a look at the place where we... Mori really does have a Mr. Satan vibe to him. And I have given the life back to your dead team members. Arrivederci, champione. Now let me turn around and not look at you while you walk away. Alrighty, what's this dragon robe about? Ooh, it looks pretty. Angelo can wear it? Alright, well, he's not wearing it. Jessica's wearing it. Because Jessica's wearing this sad flowing dress. <laughs> Which reminds me. Am I still making something in here? Yeah, I'm still making that ultimate sword. Nah, oh, we're not gonna bust it out yet. It'll be done soon. But, I do want to take a look at my recipes real quick. Because, didn't uh, Holy Clothes require a flowing dress? It did. I do have one. So I really just need to make that magical skirt to see if that's any good. But I doubt that the Holy Clothes are all that good. Maybe, maybe the, they're certainly not better than no dragon robes. But, you know, maybe... Maybe Angelo can wear them and they're better than Sacred Armor. Probably not. Maybe. Could his Sacred Armor be worn by anybody else? Nah, I could wear his Sacred Armor if we find something better for him. Mm -hmm. All things to be considered. Looks like we're all done here, I think. The Goddess Bustier. Maybe. Does this still all look the same? Are those stars filled in or anything? No. Alright. Go to the roof. There's something at the roof now. Let's go check it out before we end this stream and episode. What have we up here? A statue of me. Am I looking at the map? That's that's fitting. Ah, they they captured my image perfectly. <laughs> yep. All right. Well. <laughs> So let's just stand next to it, <laughs> save up this episode while uh, doing the pose that they decided to pose me in, which is pretty accurate because of how often I pull open the map. You'd, you'd think that it just was like glued to my face. I like maps, they're helpful. Uh, I make sure we get this all saved up. It's all good. And everything over here is still going well. Alrighty, we are going to raid up Liquid Ken. He's playing some Fortune Street. I love me some Fortune Street. He's actually playing the version that uh, released in English proper. The Nintendo Wii version, whereas the one that I was playing like a month ago was uh, an English patch translation. Munchie's in it too? I didn't notice Munchie in it. Hold on, I gotta go. We gotta look back at that real quick. There he is. Aw, he's in it. That's adorable. Alrighty. Thank you all for hanging out. It was a good time. Uh, we may have a stream randomly in the next day or two. 
Uh, you can follow me on the Discord to check that out as far as planning out streams the day after that. So I guess that would be from this point forward. Like 40 hours? In about 40 hours from now is when I plan on streaming again. Uh, there might be a random stream in between that. But that's the plan. But you can follow the Discord to keep keep up and know what's going on. Anyway, off to Liquid Ken we go. It has been fun. I'm excited that there's a lot more post-game content. Oh, well. Also intimidating because I thought that we only had a couple hours left. Oh well. Time for us to raid. Everybody get ready. We're doing it. I'm gonna go watch some Fortune Street Plus. Or Monopoly Plus, which is Fortune Street. It's like Monopoly with all this whole bunch of extra stuff. It's cool. Check it out. Yeah, you went. Oh.